What's up, pups? How you guys doing? I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. Today is a seriously awesome day for females, I guess, and males too. Mostly females, if you're living in Texas, because Wendy Davis is now the queen of the vages. Yes, you heard me right. Queen of the vages. She is basically Daenerys Targaryen in actual human being form due to the fact that she spent 13 grueling hours on her feet speaking the entire time to shut down the abortion bill that was about to be passed in Texas. I'm not sure if you guys know anything about that abortion bill, um, given that not everyone lives in Texas, obviously, and I don't even live in Texas. Um, but basically what the bill was going to do, it was going to put so many stipulations in place for abortion clinics that more than, I think, 95% of them would be forced to shut down and women could not have an abortion after 20 weeks and it would become a felony. Like, you could go to jail for having an abortion. Um, which would honestly just lead to really bad situations for women because you know that I, <laughs> no matter if there's a bill in place or not or a, a law in place or not, people are always going to break the rules. And in this case, it would have been broken in a very dangerous way. So... Wendy Davis, who uh, is currently in office in Texas, decided that she was going to filibuster this bill, and she spent 13 hours on her feet from 11 a.m. to after midnight, basically just speaking the entire time about the bill, and she never stopped. She read testimonies from doctors and people who have had abortions and people who have had miscarriages and people who don't want their rights to have an abortion taken away, and... What's crazy about it is that I've always thought that filibusters are super strange. Um, I went to, obviously, university and studied political science, and I was going to go to law school. So I had to learn about what a filibuster is. And basically, it's a time period where you're trying to get a bill thrown out. Um, and a filibuster can go on for 10 minutes to 13 hours to 13 days. It doesn't matter as long as that person who is there is standing up, speaking, never stopping, that filibuster is still in effect, and the bill cannot be passed while that person is still speaking. Um, so what's crazy about it is that there's a lot of different stipulations and rules in place about a filibuster. You can't lean on anything, you can't sit down, you can't ask for help, you have to be speaking the entire time, and it's kind of like a three strikes you're out thing. So if you do any of these things three times, your filibuster is null and void, and the bill can be passed. And Wendy Davis stuck it out like a champ, for 13 hours on her feet in her awesome pink sneakers and she got the bill thrown out and all I can say is that for one person to come in and change the lives of every single woman in Texas no matter if you're planning on having an abortion or not your rights were about to be violated and taken away she changed all of that which is incredible for one person to do that and that's why I say she is just like Daenerys Targaryen she is the mother of badges because she just changed everything for every woman in Texas. And I just wish that more people could be like her in office because she's an incredible human being. And that, it, just, it just blows my mind that she was able to, to change something like this. She was able to stop something horrible from happening. <sighs> what are your guys' thoughts? Like, what are your guys' thought on, thoughts on this? I'm not asking if you support abortion. I'm not asking if you don't support or support or I can't speak. I'm not asking if you support or don't support abortion. I'm simply asking, what are your thoughts on the ability of one person to make a difference? Do you think that what she did was noble and honorable? Do you disagree? I mean, this is a 50-year-old lady we're talking about who actually was a teen mom herself. So I'm just curious what your guys' thoughts are and how do you feel about it? Because for me, I feel like we made a huge difference today. And I don't even live in that state, and I'm just so proud of her. And I think more people should be like her. So, leave your thoughts down below in the comments, and as always, I will put on a new video in a few days. Peace out, Trouts.